since I got here and best believe I don't think I can stay here I literally had a panic attack this afternoon when I saw the rooms and it's a thing where they are giving out the rooms like accordingly like this room has to be full before they go to the next room and I've just been waiting like waiting oh my god like this is literally my worst nightmare coming to real life <laughs> So i'm laughing but i'm in so much freaking pain i've been waiting since morning for them to get to like a room that i can at least manage but at this point i haven't gotten a room <sighs> breathe chill man you know what we'll talk later Hi guys good morning so today is this is Tuesday or Wednesday I'm not even sure again but today is the swearing in ceremony thing but I'm still in the room right now because I forgot my tag so now I came to get my tag but then I decided to clean my shoes and lay my edges and I don't know I put the scarf because my edges actually never stay all day so let's see if it will stay now and I packed my hair in a different way today and I actually like it but yeah that's about it i want to go for obs now i don't know if i should just stay like you know when you manage to get in it's like i'm already inside i might as well not go back to get but yeah that's about it so i just want to get ready then leave or maybe stay i'll let you guys know this is the second time i've tried to make this video and people keep coming in so we're going to try again this now we are fully like now i'm not a prospective core member again like i'm a core part like now i'm a core member like i'm a core part <laughs> Hi guys so it's been a hot minute oh my stomach is paining me but i think i'm about to fall sick because i already have so thirsty the call is coming and i don't know if it's going to hold on guys you know the funniest thing just happened it was my mom that was calling me i was just about to tell you guys about my ppa issue and stuff i remember that just called me asking if i want to work in a school if i want to teach mm -mm, i'm not finished teaching myself i'm gonna teach somebody Mm. but anyways i have mm. been okay but i feel like i'm falling sick i haven't literally be i haven't like participating or like anything because obviously i'm obs but aside that 
nothing much has been happening same old waking up at 4 30 going to parade ground all of that but i have been looking forward to work and that has been stressing me the f out like proper stressing me out but i think i'm just going to take a break for now i sent an email to an agent and i'm just waiting for their reply but yeah my skin is i don't know my skin okay yeah, i'm breaking out here <laughs> Hi, good morning everybody. Today is Saturday. I felt really sick yesterday, but thank God I'm feeling better today. But yeah, today is Saturday. We have like this debate thing going on. Then Hypo is like hosting something as well. But anyways, white on white today's fit. And then <laughs> white on white today's fit. And then we have shoe. And yeah, but yeah, that's what it. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Use you your camera to show off my video. Like examples like okay so guys i realized that i'm literally going to have to do a voiceover for some parts because there are literally some clips that literally have no context so basically on this day we were having like a lecture we basically had lectures like almost every day and i think it had to do with like you know in case there's like a fire outbreak like how to like you know put out the fire so i wasn't really paying attention to be honest because these things were so draining like we're under the sun and it was so freaking hot but i think it was nice I mean, do these people look happy? I don't know, honestly. But yeah, when we're done, I was just walking around and then I went to have lunch. Honestly, this food now that I'm looking at it, it looks really struggle, but well, that's what you get. Then I think I was talking to somebody, honestly, I can't remember who I was talking to, but I went to have lunch with a friend. This is me. I realized I didn't have any video with like my white and white. So I was just thinking that, oh, okay, let me just have one. This is what the kitchen looked like. I think my platoon was on duty that day, honestly. I'm not sure. Then later that evening, we had this, was it? platoon competition dancing yes i think so yes it was like it was actually fun honestly because me personally i would skip everything but i did not skip this it was nice to watch see they a good day actually i shouldn't do this update now because we're about to start something else hopefully you guys can even hear me i think this is going to be my new microphone i am using a human tripod right now so i'll i think i'll talk to you guys later because yeah <laughs> hi guys so we are going for side training now i feel like i haven't done like a proper intro do you want to say hi anyways i am with the camera here <laughs> and we are basically going to take pictures and videos and join the side training uh, we should probably start from here but i don't want people to think i'm recording them okay bye So guys we are done with the side lectures actually the guest speaker came she didn't so do anything <laughs> she didn't do anything she didn't we are done it. with the side lecture and we're going to because i'm in obvious obviously working hard we have, <laughs> we have to go and get the guest speaker in and, and introduce her I basically get everything on camera. Yes, God, do. I work really hard. I did oh my work. goodness. I did, I did all the hard work. <laughs> we are currently waiting for the guest speaker to come. But well, they are practicing their salute thing. Let me show you guys. I don't know if you guys will see clearly. Yeah, they are here. But yeah. not me actually hiding to vlog because i'm shy but we are currently going to mommy i'm here with jay i'm going to eat now so yeah <sighs> long day this is honestly what my regular day is but today i decided to actually say let me show you what mommy market looks like 
people are coming behind me i'm so shy let me quickly show you um okay so basically this is mommy market and we have food spots literally everywhere so i'm trying to run to get food before it's full bye Toby, Toby now. Toby. No, no. Guys, it's time for manual drills. So, let's go. So, hi guys. What do you just give me? Ah, this back place is so disgusting. But, anyways, hi guys. I am done with the second thing. I hate this place. Thank you. Um, I want to go and look. Okay, let me do this. Ah, it's still showing. Oh my goodness. I think I should just do this. What the hell am I doing? Okay, I need to go and look for platinum 2 inspector because i didn't write my name in book of life and yeah i need to sort that out and i didn't feel the old form i have basically just been existing on this campground and yeah and i don't want to have to go to the for something when i'm back to the island so no i'm going to go and look for it now guys the platinum leader is not there so i don't know what to do because well i don't like all this unnecessary stress i don't even know who to go and meet now because i don't want any official to insult me that's my biggest fear now Honestly, guys, I can't remember what happened on this day. I just know after the man award thing, I was just extremely exhausted. I think I had just mentally checked out of camp, can't lie. But obviously, it was kind of like my safe space. So I just went there because I just wanted to be away. Hi, guys. So I am at Mami trying to eat. And I just wanted to record myself eating Amala. And I feel like if I bend it too much, it's going to pour. Okay, I'll just put it on the screen. Basically, I'm eating Amara, Edu, and Pomo, and the added beggary. I think I don't, I'm sure I'm not pronouncing it right, chap. But yeah, let's get my reaction on camera. Yeah, one water. Thank you. Sorry for using my left hand. Um, okay, so um. It's actually not bad. Mumi is in his own world with one full plate of amala. I don't know if you guys can see. Like, but so, what do you think about the amala? Hi guys. So, first off, there's this pimple on my face. I don't even know if you guys can hear me. But they just had their parade and I overslept. So I couldn't watch it. It's today that I overslept that soldiers did not come to wake us up. But when it's lectures, you will see they will be the first set of people to wake you up. And apparently today's one was interesting, so I feel kind of bad. And I wanted to watch my friend march, so yeah, that's there. But aside that I'm good, everyone is just happy and you know NYS gets nice and more relaxed towards the end. I feel like noise is getting too much now. I'll talk to you guys later. Okay, so basically, this was just kind of like platoon parade competition type thing. They were just competing against each other. Personally, I didn't get it at first because to me, it was like, you're all doing the same thing. So what's the difference? But it was later that I realized that it had to do with like, I think teamwork and I don't know, to be honest. I don't know. Then the soldiers decided to match for us too. Or were they supposed to? I can't honestly remember. Behind the scenes of newscasting, Behind the scenes. OBS. Hi guys. I want to say shout out to all the law students that just passed their back <laughs> finals. And yes, our friend Jay passed. Our sweetheart, so, not our friend. Our sweetheart. Guys, we are finally done eating. Oh, I forgot to say. We came back to the Amar place again. And Basically, we came back to eat Amala again because it's not like I like it, but it's just nice when everyone is eating the same thing. What are you doing? You're just so lucky I can't turn this camera around. I'm taking this on. I'm guessing it's on camera. You're going to eat like a tush guy. It's like a tush guy. <laughs> <laughs> 
I chop this guy, but I chop this guy means he's still for clothes. Best friend, no gay sense. Best friend, my best friend. All this English, when this guy is speaking, all get girlfriend for this country. I'm not saying through the sea, because the sea is to see you. Through the sea. You know I'm feeling captivated. That's why I'm motivated. That's cool, me and my mom. Yeah. 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 I will talk to you guys more later, but they just gave me injection on my bum and it would not stop paining me. So I'm in so much pain. And then my face, I've been having rashes, but you know what? Today is meant to be a fun day, so I'm just going to try to enjoy it. That's why I'm still out here and I'm not sleeping. But you guys should say hi to me. Peace and me. guys at this point i was really sick so i had mentally checked out i can't remember but let me just try my best so this kind of our thing is just like a cultural thing i think different platoons will pick like different cultures and like represent and present and they'll pick the winner so yeah this was like the winning platoon and they were just rejoicing yeah i think yeah. hi guys it's been a really 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 long day so basically last night after the whole like what i don't even know what to call it the whole dancing social activity and stuff i came down with like terrible sore throat so it started with sore throat obviously thinking that okay when i wake up this morning it'll be better but i woke up this morning and i couldn't lift myself from my bed and i was crying literally could not take myself to the bathroom and that was literally how everything started i was really really sick <sighs> but i'm okay now i went to the clinic they gave me injections my ass is still paining me by the way so I'm hoping that I will get better. I've decided to start seeing positive things in my life. So I'm happy, I'm well, I'm good. And Jay is here with me. Do you want to say hi? Probably not. Anyways, what else is happening? Um, yeah, basically, Canva was today. Ah, this lightning is. Canva was today. Everything was fine. Everything was honestly awesome. That's why I was like, why is it now when me, like, life is getting interesting that I now want to fall sick? I didn't fall sick when we we're going to, like, lectures where you want to tear your head. Because when they're having like nice things and tomorrow is Miss NYSC. Two days ago was Miss Bold and Beautiful. Like nice things are actually happening because I think can gets better towards the ending. But anyways, I'm already talking way too much. So this is the day they were having like the platoon football finals. I think platoon three one if I'm not mistaken. But guys, at this point the sickness got really, really bad. Like you can literally see from my face that you know i was literally on my last life like i could not even believe that i was still standing but i was taking my drugs so it was calm then at this point they were giving the yeah the winning football team their medal and then their cup i think yeah but yeah i was just basically here because i didn't want to go back to my room because i just kept sleeping and you know when you have malaria and you're sleeping it literally makes it worse so i was just like i might as well just be outside i'm moving so i feel like a little better but later that evening shot i got better then it go body again the next day but anyways that's aside yeah everyone was just rejoicing <laughs>
the last lecture we had at camp i mean why would i not record this like why not anyways later that day obs had to cover like this send forth event for like this official that was retiring like it was really calm but honestly i got really tired and sick again so i had to leave because i needed to eat and like take my drugs and just rest because my neck was really really stiff so i just had to wait and then got my food and then i left <sighs> hi guys so we just left that hall we went for oh. our not even our like there was this there's this official that is like retiring so they had like a retirement party for her and obs had to cover that no the lightning is better here so obs had to cover that and yeah bumi is my human tripod because i'm still very weak and i literally can't stand on my own but Come i'm not on, looking i mean he's the best photographer ever and the camera is here but anyways I'm looking better now. I'm not looking like I'm suffering and anyway, I still have rashes on my face yeah, but be yeah, it's be better here. But aside that, I think I'm honestly doing better. I mean, okay, my throat is still very sore and I still can't move my neck but I'm beginning to think I actually slept on my neck and it's not even the malaria that's causing it. But I stopped using my pillow. Let's go this way. I stopped using my pillow so i'm hoping that it gets better now so i'll update you guys on like everything that has been happening because jay has been vlogging for me and i've been vlogging but i think i'll do a voiceover for that part but we're leaving camp tomorrow i'm happy to be going back to lagos and yeah let's see what happens after camp yo what's up guys i charge five hundred dollars <laughs> no i won't miss you book him for your pictures and all of that <laughs> yeah, I won't miss you. i'll talk to you guys in a bit <laughs> so guys i'm basically here to eat and I feel like mommy has honestly never been this quiet. Like, no one is walking around. It's so peaceful. And that's probably because they're having a program. And I have to come and eat because I have to take my drugs. Like, my neck is so stiff right now. I have to take my drugs. So I came to get Ofada. Who would have genuinely thought that I would survive three weeks in NYC camp? Not me. <laughs> People are staring at me while I'm vlogging. Not like core members who, like people here they're like is this babe okay <laughs> but this is me again mommy is empty like i'm so free to vlog when people are here i just never do this because i'm always way too shy and i'm a very awkward babe so it's like i'd rather not the offer was not bad i never really rate offer till like five hours later because normally when i take offer that i'm not used to i always have heart born so let's see if i like it <laughs> so, hi guys, we are done. I finally got to take this, but I've not taken my drugs, which is bad because mm, my tongue, I knew it would be yellow, but sorry, orange whatever first of all i need to get home and get rid of all these rashes on my face i think it's because i've been using the toilet in my water and normally i don't use the toilet in my water so that has been now nah, this is bad like it's giving rashes you get but yeah i'm doing fine i haven't fainted yet i haven't died yet so if i can do it you can do it too it's a wrap i'm done i'm finally taking my box downstairs see me sweating this is not the life i signed up for my neck is proper stiff i think 
it comes back when I'm stressing myself so I probably just need proper rest and yeah I'm going home now so when next you guys see me I'll probably be in Lagos but I have so much to tell you guys about NYSC but I just can't do it now I, it looks like I'm okay but I'm actually not okay but you know how malaria works like when you're active you're active but at night let's say from like 4 p.m. you start going downhill so I need to go and get myself checked so I you know what? I'll talk to you guys later but this is the last vlog in room and in camp in general I don't think I ever vlogged in my room okay I think at least once and that's just because I didn't want to be showing people's things in my vlogs and people in my vlog because obviously they're in their room they should feel safe but yeah that's about it future trauma here i'm back home obviously i mean so much has happened i'm still working i'm currently at the office but you guys will find out more about that in like the vlog after this one so please subscribe so you don't miss it but i just wanted to give like my two cents on like my experience and like just some things i feel like you guys should know so first things first my experience was actually calm like i mean obviously every single calm this thing will have their yeah, cons where it was calm but will i do it again probably not just just because i don't like stress so first thing i'll tell you your hairstyle just do something really nice because you don't have time to like be packing your hair every morning it will break out if your hair is constantly in your face that's one two don't take anything expensive i mean i mean that's one sense just don't take anything expensive go in and check the rooms first because guys you guys saw me nagging in this video about like my living situation i just did not like it so check the rooms first. don't just register because some of the rooms are but try and get lagos like if you don't get lagos i don't know about other camps but lagos is just bearable and like the stress and everything is less but lagos is, has its own shop but it's just bearable do you feel me take the tour and be consistent with your skincare routine guys the only reason why my skin is still thriving is because i literally did not miss any day of my skincare like mm -mm, skincare every single day then lastly join obs don't go there and be lazy shy. if you actually know how to do the work just join obs it makes your working it's like comfortable kind of thing you get so yeah i feel like that's everything so i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up subscribe to my channel so you can follow my journey on what life after nyc camp is like and i love you guys bye